All right, welcome again to this uh, new video of lordofthejars.com where uh, in this uh, video I'm going to introduce you a new CLI tool called BAT. Not this bat, of course. It's bat, which is a you know a cat replacement. And uh, nowadays, as a developer, we need to deal with really big configuration files. Just think about Kubernetes uh, resources files or Istio resources, right? Which is quite big, and you know it follows some kind of um, format like JSON or um, or YAML. So let's see how bat can uh, help us to you know, inspect these files. Okay, this is the site of BAT, which is in GitHub. So you, you need, just need to go to github.com slash sharkdp slash BAT. And then to install it, you just need to go to um, releases, you choose the version, choose your platform, choose your operative system, you download it, you put it, the binary in your path um, variable, and that's all. So let's see an example. The first thing that we're going to see is using cat, how something looks like. And you can go here and you see that it's, you know, a black and, and white output. And if I want to see something at the top of this file, I need to using my mouse and a scroll up and down to see it, right? Or, for example, you can use more or less CLI tools for, you know, scrolling automatically. But let's see how this looks like with that. I'm going to <coughs> print the same thing and that first thing that you will notice is that it's a really nice uh, output, which is, you know, it detects the kind of file, which is a YAML file, and then it just, you know, add some colors so it's easy to read. But not only this, it also adds your pagination. So I can move my um, file using the arrow keys up and down to just scroll. So I get it, in, let's say, um, pagination by default. I don't need to, you know, pipe the output. Another thing that it offers is that I can do something like this, which basically I'm saying that that saying to bad that please show me all the files that start with destination rule. And again, you can see here that uh, there is there's all the files that start with destination rule, as you may expect it. And I can you know move up and down for you know checking the content of all the files. Also, another. Um, Future that it offers is that I can, for example, do the next thing. But for now, it's for the sake of simplicity, I'm going to do something that it's not legal, but it works for this purpose. I've just modified the file, and then I can do a bad is two files destination rule recommendation b1 v2, and you can see here that I, there is a plus saying that this line has been added. This happens because um, bad communicates with git and add or enrich the output with some um, git um, actions. In this case is that a new um, line has been added in the file. And that's, that, that's all for bat, but it's a replacement, it, or it can be used as a replacement of cat, because it, I mean that everything that is valid in cat is also valid in bat, and you can pipe the output of any process to bat without any problem. Great! Hope that you enjoyed it. Hope that you find this uh, video um, useful. If you enjoyed, then thumbs up, um, subscribe to the channel, or follow me on Twitter so you can get all the updates of all my um, future videos that I'm going to record about Java, uh, CLI tools for making developers' life easier, or for example, also Kubernetes, Istio, and so on and so far. See you!